Good morning, it is October 20th, 2018, and I'm in New Carrollton, making my way up from Richmond, New Carrollton, Maryland. Stopped off at 7-Eleven, and um, some Ethiopian men here at the counter, and um, I was asking them about where they're from and everything, and um, <laughs> a couple years ago, I started to understand one of the words in my prayer language. I thought it was from uh, the Congo. I felt the Lord tell me I would I would go to the um, to Africa one day, um, to the Congolese specifically. I don't even know where Ethiopia is, but I've been asking him what that was all about because Kuriata uh, Kumiata, uh, but Kuriata is, is a very common word in my prayer language. Almost every time I'm praying, Kuriata, 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 Kuriata. I looked it up and, and, and I found it in the, um, I believe in Latin or the Greek, um, the one day, it, the day that I could, I could read Greek <laughs> is the day I figured out it means gathering. So anyway, that was like a year ago. So I'm in here today with my friend, what's your name? Petros? Is that your real name? <laughs> that you're not Peter. What's your real name? Are you Peter? Yeah. Pet, pet Peter. He's so with Peter. He's from Ethiopia, and um, we were talking, and he mentioned this. He said Kuria, Kuriata, and I said, wait a second, um, because I have a melody that I haven't used yet, and it, and I, and I, it's sort of like I halfway use my prayer language and just sort of make up words, like I did when I was a little kid. I used to make up melodies and just random words because I, I wouldn't have a word to speak but I would make up these little songs when I was cleaning the house actually I'd go around just singing 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 um, it seemed I always sang the lion sleeps tonight in the jungle the night jungle the lion sleeps tonight and I would go off on that song and just make up melodies and sounds I remember that clearly and um, but one of the melodies I have is um now I'm forgetting. Hold on a moment. It just took me a second. And then it goes on. But so when I met him, I started humming the song, and he's like, "Do you know Ethiopian?" Yeah. And and I said, "No." And then he wouldn't tell me. He started laughing. He's like, "I won't tell you what that word is because I'm I'm still not." Mm. He's he's over there smiling and laughing. But finally, I said, "Look, I've been waiting for like years to find out what this means," and he said, "It means love." So we're gonna ask him what it means. Now he's laughing at me. Okay, so tell me what that word means in Ethiopian. <laughs> Tell me what it means, please. I did, I told you, right? About for love. It means it means love. But the way he said it, it must have a sort of a different meaning where he's from, because he was giggling a lot. All right, so thank you, Peter. God bless you. All right, have a good day. Thanks. All right, so that's um, it's like 5:45 in the morning. God bless you.